1935, six years after the stock market crash, the Great Depression still gripped the nation's economy. That same year, Franklin Roosevelt initiated the Works Progress Administration to boost the recovery by funding hundreds of long-sought building projects. A key part of the New Deal, the WPA funded nearly 8 million jobs constructing public buildings, parks, and roads. Almost every community in America has a park, bridge, or school constructed by the agency. In Little Falls, local residents had long been lobbying for a better water supply because, as a report stated, the city water showed by test a hardness rarely equaled, and in addition it carried a high percentage of iron and manganese. So the city turned to WPA funding for a new water treatment plant. The initial plans were substantial in scope. It would be a combined recreation center and water softening plant with a granite swimming pool surrounded by granite walls, bathhouses, two tennis courts, a volleyball court, a horseshoe court, and two sunken baseball diamonds that would double as ice skating rinks in the winter. Next door would be the water treatment plant. All told, it would employ 300 men for a full year to build. It was the only combined WPA project of its kind in the state, and in the end, proved to be much too ambitious. The recreation center and the park were judged too expensive and dropped. The plant was placed into operation in the spring of 1937 and served the water department until 1973 when a new facility was completed across the street. The water treatment plant was remodeled into Little Falls City Hall in 1977. Visually striking, the building was designed in the sleek Art Modern style and uses stone from the Little Falls Black Granite Company, which owned a local quarry and finishing plant. Beginning with approximately 25 employees in 1918, the company's workforce expanded as demand grew throughout the United States for the unusual black granite. At its peak, the business had an annual payroll of 38 employees. The legacy of the WPA in Little Falls went well beyond the new water purification plant and the job saved at the black granite company. WPA workers built the rock walls and other structures at Pine Grove Park, improved Lindbergh State Park, and built an auditorium addition to the high school. City Hall is now one of the most visible local reminders of the well-designed public buildings that are the legacy of the Works Progress Administration.